My name is Sarah Drummond and I am from Snook. I'm Jason. I'm the Director of Design, Data, Digital and Technology at Bernardo's. One in eight young people have a mental health challenge um, and we think that there is a, a, a kind of blossoming, more than blossoming, um, array of apps and digital services out there. But what we've seen from analysing some of them um, prior to this project beginning is that some of them are not good and they miss some of the basic foundational things you need to have in place to make sure that a service is safe and it's ethical um, and it will support young people in the right way. The youth mental health environment has changed a lot in the last few years. So. Uh, what used to be a, a landscape which was really kind of driven by commissioning requirements by local authorities has, has really opened up um, into a world where the NHS is involved, other health organisations are involved, there's much more of a drive to integrate health and social care um, so that a child is at the centre of a whole system uh, of support. Snook and Bernardo's are working together on this nominate funded piece of work um, to build a pattern library which is like a toolkit to help charities understand and know what good practice looks like in delivering digital services for young people focusing on mental health. We know that there are many services out there which are built on brilliant building blocks. Um, what we want to do through this work is to highlight which of those building blocks work, um, what comes of putting them into practice, um, how we evidence that they are a success and then help organisations all around the country. It provides lots of solutions to solve problems. So if I'm a charity and I'm trying to build a new app that might provide some form of you know, cognitive behavioural therapy um, in a digital format, I might not have the confidence to build an app or know what that looks like. So what the Pattern Library does is help you know what all the elements and features are of building that kind of app or service. And again, for us, it's about building that confidence that charities know that they're getting the basics right. 